welcome to Amazing Art. Today we are going to be finishing our St. Patrick's Day project. If you haven't seen our first video, you should go and see it. Um, and and it's the link is in the oh, description. So I hope you guys can go see that video before you do this, because there are some steps that we did before we did this one. Okay. One. Okay. So now let's get started. So first. Peel. So from last time, we paint. We had a shamrock shape, and we painted over it. So now we need to peel the shamrock now shape, it's, shape off. Now it's, it's, it's broken. It's not broken. Here, just peel it. You can break it if you want. I want mine peeled. I, I don't want a broken peel. Well, it's supposed to be broken. Why? Okay, so the first thing that you need are some scissors. So, for the scissors, see how um, I did this? You might need to pick at it a little bit with the scissors or a pocket knife because the stem is a little bit hard if you don't do card stock or like if you Wait, don't do card stock or anything. Okay? So, this is what it should turn out to be like. And so now we're going to be cutting strips of green paper because what we're going to do, we're going to have little rolls on the shamrock to make it look 3D, okay? Okay, we need to get some scissors. I, we're going to get them for you. Hold on a sec. This is going to do some magic. Okay, so I know. So for, we need to get some scissors for these edges because apparently they are complaining that they do not have scissors and I do. Okay? There. Now, we, now they have scissors. Okay, so now we are gonna cut a bunch of strips because we gotta roll them into rolls like this. Three. Okay, so here we go. Here's a little roll. So with the little rolls, we gotta get some glue. 